when I talk to patients, you know, often their most significant fear is that we're going to end up disabled or even worse that I might outlive my brain and end up with dementia and memory problems. And our country doesn't have a very good track record with disability. We spend more years with chronic disease than people in many other developed countries. Now, if I told you I had a pill that could, would, is proven to prevent memory loss, improve IQ actually, prevent cancer, prevent and treat obesity, diabetes, high blood pressure, heart disease, uh, chronic fatigue, depression, and prevent disability. And it comes with virtually no side effects and really costs nothing. What would you say? Oh my gosh, it's too good to be true, isn't it? Well, what if I told you that vitamin is exercise? Why the groan? Is that so difficult to do? Why, why are we so stuck to the couch? You know, we're stuck in a sedentary lifestyle that we gotta get out of, and you can't delegate that to anybody else. Don't complicate it. Let me simplificate. You don't need a gym membership. You don't need a personal trainer. Are we really that in disabled? You don't need to complicate it with equipment. You just need to move. Just simple things like get up and do jumping jacks or pace the room for two minutes every 30 minutes that you're sitting. Turn off the TV and play with your kids. You know, have you ever watched a two-year-old in natural motion? Well, what happens when we turn on a movie? We just glue them to the couch. It's like a bug trap. You know, turn off the TV and get moving. Go for a walk after a meal. It's a really nice way to communicate with your family, with your spouse, with a friend. Do walking meetings. There are lots and lots of simple ways in your day to get more active. And I can guarantee there is no more important health benefit and health decision that you make than to get moving every day.